Hello viewers, Banana Boss here with another scratch tutorial. So I decided to do another one because I just thought something I have not shown you guys at all. Today I'm going to show you how to use lists. So if you don't know what lists are, basically they're huge lists of words and everything like that. So I'm going to show you how to create a really simple thing and let's just show you an example and let me just show you the example of what I've created. So let's just do this. Um, Alright, and now when you click the sprite, apples 5, pears 10, cakes 2. Alright, so. Now I'm going to show you how to make it so that, so new, let's just save that. And let's create a new variable first, which will be done. This is if you want to add the thing where it says it. So now let's just call this shopping list. Alright, so. Actually, let's delete that and change the name. Let's make it shopping list, like that. All right, so what we want to do is, when start is clicked, um, we want to delete all of shopping list. And now what we want to do is repeat until done equals true which will be when the sprite is clicked, so repeat until done equals true ask what do you need from the shop and it will add answer to shopping list and now what we want to do is when this sprite clicked set done to true now what we want to do let's make sure that done is false and won't stay is true at the beginning now what we want to do is say and in data shopping list so it's not literally going to say shopping list it's going to say what's in there all right so let's test this so let's say apples times five Chips, crisps. Well, if you're American, then crisps are chips, but I'm British. So. Um, pears times three. Ki ki kiwis times seven. Bananas times fifteen. All right, now let's click. Apples five, chips, crisps. Pears times 3, kiwi times 7, bananas times 15. There's one more thing you might want to do. You might want to put something at the beginning that says to put a comma at the at the end of each one. Re remember to put a comma after each item. No, after in each answer. All right, now let's just clean up and let's show you this. Remember to put a comma in each answer. All right, let's just make that five seconds. And now let's start. So, apples times five, bananas times times fifteen, pears times seven, eight, um, crisps. And I forgot to put a comma afterwards, but oh well. Alright, so apples times 5, bananas times 15, pears times 8, and crisps. So I hope you enjoyed, hope this helps. Please like, comment, favourite and subscribe. It means so much to me and I will see you all next time. Banana Boss, out.